Modern Warfare multiplayer will feature interactive in-game Tamagotchi digital pets. The fuck? Dude, I fucking hope so. Wait, is that... Did you actually read that somewhere? It wouldn't surprise me, like, the with the shit, like, with the watch. Like, you could probably, like, fucking have a watch, like, a Tamagotchi around your fucking wrist instead of a watch. <laughs> That'd be sick, dude. It's from Dextero. Charlie Intel posted it. Shut the fuck up. How long ago? Can somebody link that tweet? I'm not seeing it. Oh my god! There we go. We got a link. We got a link. We got a link. Let's check her out, dude. No fucking way. This is amazing. Modern Warfare multiplayer will feature interactive in-game Tamagotchi digital pets. The upcoming Call of Duty Modern Warfare game will give players an interactive wrist toy. I called it. I fucking knew it. Called Tama Tamagunchi to wear in-game when playing multiplayer. That is fucking awesome. People are probably freaking out about this. I'm excited. As of October 25th, re as the October 25th release date for Modern Warfare continues to creep closer, more and more information about the highly anticipated title is being revealed. The latest bit of detail to be revealed come came on August 6th, courtesy of Game Informer, who announced that the next COD title will feature a digital pet known as Tamagunchi. Wow, let me pause. I think it's trying to play. Pause, bitch. I don't want you to play. Okay, fuck off. When equipped, players will be able to interact with the toy in-game as it will react out loud to how the wear is performing during any giving match. What? This little thing on your wrist, every time you get a string of kills, it goes, Yata! And it makes a little noise. Then you look at it, and it evolved out of an egg, said the art director Joel Emsley. Emsley? Tamagunchis are fed by the player's performance in multiplayer. It's just a little active wristwatch thing. Wow. In the name... If the name Tamagunchi sounds familiar, that's because it is. Modern Warfare Wrist Toy was inspired by Tamagotchi, a handheld digital pet released in the late 90s that quickly became one of the most popular toys of its generation. Much like the original concept, the original or the Modern Warfare version will also need to be taken care of and nurtured, and players can do that by performing well in game or risk the chance of the pet suffering death. Dude, that'll be cool if you can, like, I don't know, get it, you know, like fucking evolve it or some shit, or like unlock clothes and stuff for it or something if you don't take care of your tamagunchi it will rot and die said Ems emsley the art director also revealed that it was not their primary plan to go with a wrist toy initially brainstorming ideas like having a device that would provide stat tracking and would work similarly to a smartwatch however with the ideas growing into more and more madness the developers ultimately decided to go with a digital pet for those who want to lighten the mood in the midst of heated battle. This is, of course, yet another aspect of Modern Warfare that is totally new to the world of Call of Duty. And it's not even the only usable item players will be able to wear on their wrist in-game. Oh, really? Infinity Ward confirmed several weeks ago that every player's character will be fitted with a watch that will tell their exact time based on the time zone in which they are playing. Okay, so I saw that. It's clear that the developers are going are doing everything they can to raise the bar, although we'll just have to wait and see how well a digital pet will work in a mature, rated, first-person shooter. I'm excited. That's kind of fucking cool. I mean, I guess it's not really anything to get excited about, but I think it's cool. That's fucking funny. 